When the Paralympics begin next Tuesday in Tokyo, Clayton Braun will not be there in person, but Braun's designs will be. You see, Braun has been hard at work in Troy, Missouri, coming up with a better way for athletes and others with disabilities to get around. Building a better wheelchair. I've always grown up building things and designing things. It takes precision. Definitely say it's skilled. Everything must be in the right place. When that chair comes back to him, we want it to be dead on. Clayton Braun knows firsthand why that is so important. I was unconscious in the ICU for a month. Why the proper fit is desired. Dove off the back of a boat and uh, landed on the top of my head. Because Clayton is on wheels himself. Technically a C5, C6 quadriplegic. The accident 18 years ago may have taken away his ability to walk. And what are you going to do? You're either going to sink or swim. But it did not take away his determination. Once I figured out a way to be competitive again from a chair, it was, you know, it was a done deal. Competitive enough to make the U.S. Paralympic rugby team a competitive spirit he continues to use. The lessons that I can take away from playing at an elite level, I can apply everywhere else in life, especially right here. While he no longer plays, you will see athletes in his chairs at the Paralympics. It's just as good as, to me, it's just as good as being there on that podium. In brand new chairs. As soon as I thought of that, I was like, that's clever. And founding brand new has given Clayton a new passion in life. What separates you from the rest? <laughs> The amount of heart and uh, effort, blood, sweat, and tears we put into these things. <laughs> is building wheelchairs your new competition? Is building world yes. wheelchairs your new sport? Yes, absolutely. One of the U.S. Paralympians that you'll see in one of Braun's chairs is Chuck Melton from Centralia, Illinois. He's the captain of the rugby team and one of Braun's former teammates. That is